A Durant woman is counting her blessings tonight. She believes she dodged a bullet because she wasn't home when her house caught fire. She told News 12's Danielle King while she lost everything, it could have been worse. What once was a three bedroom house has been reduced to ashes. For 37 years, Willeen Boulding's family called this place home. It's just such a shock to see your family home in flames and ashes. In the wee hours of Saturday morning, Boulding got a call from firefighters that's burned into her memory. I just was in shock and I said, it's on fire. And he said, yes, ma'am, it's burned totally to the ground already. She rushed home to check on her great Pyrenees, George, and Callie, the calico cat. When she got there, she found the blaze still going, with dozens of firefighters working frantically. When the smoke cleared, she realized Callie didn't make it. My cat was in the house, and I, I don't think she could get out. I, my little calico kitten, she was my daddy's little cat. While she's mourning the loss of her beloved pet, Bolding realizes things could have been much worse. Flames sparked around 3 a.m. Saturday, a time she normally would have been sound asleep if it wasn't for her friend, Diane Hall. Sorry to have a heart problem, but I'm praising God that she was here with me and that those box springs over there would, would have been where she would have been sleeping. I'm just thankful to have my life. I feel like if I had been here that I may have perished too. The Oklahoma State Fire Marshal will soon begin their investigation into what caused the fire. Bolding says she does have insurance. In Bryan County, Danielle King, News 12.